Hey guys, Rolia or Taylor here, and today I'm back with a video. And this video isn't a division based video at all. This is actually based on a game called Anthem, and this was revealed over the past couple of days at E3. Now Anthem really appeals to me because it looks like a mix of Destiny and Division. Obviously I could never really get into Destiny because of how late I found out about that genre and then Division came and filled that hole for me. And now with Anthem coming along and almost merging the both of them, that's exactly why I'm covering it on this channel. So Anthem seems to be a sci-fi looter shooter type based game. You can play with up to four players online as well as solo. In Anthem you'll be playing as a freelancer exploring a sci-fi open world. Now game director John Warner actually presented this footage and it featured a quest to save a gang of fellow freelancers. The mission took you through a jungle like area and the world and I quote from Warner the world of Anthem is hostile and threats can come from any direction. As well as enemies we also have to be careful of weather events called sharper storms. As well as that the game is also going to feature underwater exploration. You can see bits of this on your screen so make sure you're watching this as well as just listening to me. Now as a freelancer you have a heavily customizable exosuit, these are called javelins and they can come equipped with a range of new gear you can either craft or acquire. Along with that you also have a unique set of skills along with each javelin. Now like I already said this is a looter shooter and like I just said then it's about acquiring gear Well, the loot in this we've already been shown how it could be working. As you can see this small clip on the screen once he defeats this mini boss this weapon drops and it sort of gives off this little animation and then it pings up of what you've actually got. It's a level 35 legendary weapon so we know that that's going to be tiers within these weapons and especially a leveling system. Whether that's tied to the weapon or to the character we're yet to know. So what type of enemies are we going to be coming up against? against. Now we don't know any specific names or a specific species but we know they're going to be monsters and they're definitely going to be big ones. Now these monsters will be found outside of what they're calling the wall very similar to destiny and you'll need to wear your javelin to actually explore these areas and to fight these monsters. That also gives us a little bit of the clue. It sounds like you have a safe haven and once you leave the wall in your javelin you have a vast massive open world sort of overgrown earth type planet that you need to explore and I guess that's where the story will take you through this exploration. Now unfortunately I don't know too much of the story I don't really think anyone does we are only shown that small quest that you've probably seen of already. So if this hasn't gripped you then I really don't know what has. What isn't there to love about this game? A mix between Destiny and The Division with maybe Titanfall style exosuits. You're probably already asking for a release date if you are gripped to this and at the moment all we know about is fall 2018 so a good 18 months away for them to really pump out and within those 18 months I can assure you there's going to be lots of news, leaks and gameplay to go along with it. Now guys if this is a game you want me to cover then please let me know in the comments below. It's very hard for me to actually make a choice on whether to cover a game or not especially because my channel is solely based over the division. So your feedback really is very much appreciated. Now my expectations are probably a little bit too high for this game. It really grips me because like I said I was never able to get into Destiny because of how late I found the genre and with the style of this game as well as the beauty of it it definitely is something I'm looking forward to. I do want to say that this doesn't affect any division content on this channel it just means you're going to be getting more content if anything so the division is going to stay the same you're still going to have my weekly vendor resets as well as my state of the game recaps as well as all of the other division videos i make but i just want to keep this channel going and possibly branch out into other games and i thought anthem would be one of the better games to choose from so like i've already said just let me know if you want me to carry on covering this so that about wraps it up for this video. I hope you did enjoy it and if you did, let me know by either leaving a comment or by clicking that like button. And if you're new around here and want to see more content from me, then make sure you hit that subscribe button. But as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all soon. Bye bye.